Insidious Fu here. Today I'm here to do an unboxing video of HP Pavilion Gaming Desktop model number 690-0073W. So I just got this from Walmart for $450 for Black Friday and this is a great deal um, because it has 9th generation Intel Core i5-9400F processor and NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1660 Ti graphics card as well as a 256 GB of NVMe M2 solid state. So let's see what's in the box. So the first item that I see in the box is the keyboard that comes with it. So it says it's an unbranded cated USB keyboard. Pretty standard keyboard. So move that aside. And then here. It's got a bunch of accessories. Got a quick setup guide. It's very nice. <sighs> so this is a power cable. And a mouse. It's a USB mouse. And that's everything that's in this bag. And the computer itself. Carefully. Get out. So you're currently looking at the front part of the computer. Um, the front part seems a little plasticky. Um, it has the case has the HP finish in shadow black color with a brushed hairline pattern. On the left side, you will see the DVD writer. Here you have the power button, and this is a headphone microphone combo jack. This is the HP 3-in-1 media card reader. These two seem to be the uh, 3.1-in-1 USB ports. So there are two of the uh, USB 3 ports. And this is the USB Type-C port. So now let's see what's on the back of the computer. So this is the back of the computer. So on the top, you will see the audio input-output jacks. Apparently the computer comes with a 5.1 surround sound. And on the top here, you see two USB 2.0 ports, network ports. I believe that these two are um, USB 3.1 ports, and then the last two are the USB 2.0 ports. For display, you have one DVI-D port, one HDMI port, and one display port. And then on the bottom, obviously, that's where your power cable goes. And to open this case, I believe that you have to unscrew this and pull this out. So I've just opened the case and um, this is the bottom side and this is the top of the computer. On the bottom, I see a 400 watt PSU made by HP. And then you can see the graphics card right there. 
And I hope you can see, but the DVD port is here and this is the um, hard drive slot. You can put maybe one uh, regular size hard drive or possibly two. So to show you what's um, on this side of the motherboard better, I just removed the um, DVD writer. And as I've mentioned, there are two slots for RAM and then the M2 SSD is right there. Um, and then obviously you can see the network card over there. So I think that's probably what you would like to know. Yeah, that's, that's all I got um, for today. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye.